We all wish that our dogs could talk to us in our language and tell us how they are feeling inside. Unfortunately, this is not the case so we pet parents must become expert observers too and keep an eye out for early signs and symptoms of problematic health issues. Feeding your chihuahua a species-appropriate diet and monitoring their health is one of the most important things you can do for your pet, and could save you a lot of stress, time and money in the long run. Here are the basics points on what to look out for in assessing your dog's overall health. 1. An alert, happy attitude when your dog isn't resting. A healthy chihuahua exudes a love of life. Head up, eyes bright, and their tail wags with the anticipation of what may be around the corner. Your dog should be energetic, inquisitive, interested in new surroundings, and display enthusiasm for their favorite games or activities. That's why we love our dogs so much. If you notice a shift in your chihuahua's attitude that continues for more than three days and you've tried your best to cheer them up, this may be a sign of other health-related problems. Assess the other points in this article and decide if a trip to the vet is a good idea. 2. Good appetite. Generally speaking, a hungry dog is a healthy dog. Your chihuahua should consume their meal within 10 minutes or less. One of the first signs of illness, especially when a dog has a gastrointestinal upset or a fever, is a decreased interest in food. If your pup refuses food altogether for over 24 hours, you should take them to a vet to get a second opinion. 3. A shiny, full coat without bare areas. Your dog's coat is one of the most obvious physical characteristics and is a great indicator of their overall health. Sparse, dull, and dry coats are often an indicator of poor quality nutrition and a lack of good fats in their diet. One of the many benefits of feeding a high-quality, balanced raw diet is that your chihuahua's coat is lustrous, thick, and shiny again. This is one of the first things you'll notice when you switch from kibble to raw. Abnormal shedding can be a symptom of an underlying health problem. But how do you know if it's normal shedding or something is wrong? Take note of the months which your dog normally sheds so that you know whether or not it coincides with a certain time of year. If you suspect they are shedding abnormally, give your chihuahua a warm water bath and afterward comb out any remaining dead hairs so that you can examine the skin. If the skin appears healthy and you can see new shiny hairs beginning to grow, your pup may be going through their cycle of shedding. However, if the hair still seems dull, dry, broken, or isn't growing back in an area that previously had hair examine the other points on the list and see if a vet visit is warranted. 4. Clean ears. Your chihuahua's ears should be clean on the inside with a shiny thin coating that is produced by the secretion of the protective waxy substance. Their ears should not have excessive wax or a strong odor. If they have a persistent discharge that is dark brown or black, it may be a symptom of an ear infection, allergies, or hormonal imbalance. If you are still uncertain, you can take your dog to the vet and try to determine the root cause of symptoms. 5. Clear Eyes A healthy dog has bright, clear, sparkly eyes. You should be able to see through the outermost surface of the eye, the cornea and you should be able to clearly see the patterns of the iris, the brown or blue ring that gives the eye its color. Your chihuahua could benefit from regular home eye exams to look out for the following cases that may indicate a problem. Discharge and crusty gunk, tearing, red or white eyelid linings, tear-stained fur and unequal pupil sizes. Excessive tearing is common for a lot of small dog and wrinkly breeds. Their tears can cause brownish-red stains and is considered normal by many pet owners. However, it can also be a sign of allergies, especially if combined with itchy skin and gastrointestinal upset it's better to address eye-related problems sooner than later. A change in diet to species-appropriate foods can reduce the amount of tears as well as the staining. You can add the following to your chihuahua's diet to decrease the amount of staining. Milk thistle, dandelion, olive leaf, chlorophyll, colostrum, and probiotics. 6. Clean teeth, bright pink gums, and unoffensive breath. Firstly, your dog's breath should not be offensive or foul-smelling. A healthy chihuahua should have shiny gums that reach all the way to the base of the teeth. Colors of gums can vary from pink to brown and black gums. Irregardless of the breed, your dog's teeth should be white, shiny, and have no buildup of brown or yellow material along the gum line. Poor oral hygiene can lead to a variety of health problems, some are life-threatening. If you notice your chihuahua has a buildup of plaque or tartar, it's time to take action. Feed a species-appropriate raw diet that will not build up plaque and tartar, or cause a stinky breath. Additionally, you can offer raw bones, 
Choose bones that are appropriate for your chihuahua's size and temperament, or an all-natural chew that will mimic the action of a toothbrush and cleans as well as freshen your dog's breath. Alternatively, you can also brush your dog's teeth yourself or arrange for oral exams and teeth cleaning by your vet, but this is costly and may require anesthesia. 7. Normal Pulse Check your chihuahua's resting heart rate when you know it's healthy so that you have a baseline to compare with when you suspect they may be ill. If your dog has a fever or is feeling pain, their heart rate will increase. This is just one indicator that there may be a potential health problem. To determine your dog's heart rate, put your hand to his chest, count how many pulses you feel in 15 seconds and then multiply by 4 to get the number of beats per minute. How fast your chihuahua's heart beats will depend upon its age and size. Young puppies have the most rapid heartbeats, 160 to 200 beats per minute at birth and up to 220 BPM when they are 2 weeks old. An adult dog's heart beats 60 to 140 times per minute. Often larger breeds have slower the heart rate and smaller toy breeds have heart rates as high as 180 BPM. Additionally when your chihuahua exercises, the heart can beat at twice the normal rate, sometimes more. 8. Firm, regular stools. The color, consistency, and frequency of your dog's poops can tell you a lot about their overall health. It should be firm and regular, not voluminous, stinky mounds of poop often the result of kibble diets. They can range from colors depending on the foods they were eating from brown, red, green, orange or beige. If you notice your chihuahua's poops are black in color it may be a sign of gastrointestinal bleeding and chronic diarrhea, three days or more, are a cause for concern and you should see a vet immediately. An occasional loose stool or an occasional stool with mucus is normal in dogs, especially if they are switching diets. Constipation is can occur if your chihuahua has consumed too much raw bone content, but if they are continually straining to poop, have a vet check them. 9. Normal body temperature. Take your dog's temperature when they are healthy and when they are at rest as exercise can increase their temperature slightly. A healthy dog's temperature ranges between 101 to 102.5 degrees Fahrenheit or 38.3 Celsius to 39.1 Celsius. The average temperature is 101.3 Fahrenheit or 38.5 Celsius. Young puppies can vary a little outside these ranges. If a dog's temperature reaches 103 F, 39.4 Celsius or above is considered a dog fever. This could be the result of infections, vaccinations, toxins, and inflammation in the body. If the temperature reaches 106 F, 41.1 Celsius, it's due to the hot and humid climate of the UAE. This elevated temperature is very serious is called hyperthermia or heat stroke. It can be fatal, see a vet immediately. To determine your chihuahua's temperature, coat a thermometer with a lubricant such as coconut oil and gently insert the thermometer about 1 inch into your dog's bum wait for results. 10. Moderate weight. For us, this is the most important factor in improving and maintaining your chihuahua's health. More and more dogs around the world are becoming obese, which is completely due to uneducated pet owners, plain and simple. Pet obesity leads to a wide variety of health problems that can seriously affect the quality and length of your dog, life. The best way to avoid these issues is to regularly check your pet's weight and feed them a raw species-appropriate diet that is not filled with preservatives and cheap fillers that bulk up your pet.